Welcome back to Studio 10. Need for speed. If so, we just have the thing for you. Drag boat racing is coming to Baldwin County next weekend. It's the duel on the Delta. Clint Cohen is here to t give us all the details. Clint, welcome to Studio 10. Thank you. We have talked to Clint before last year for the first annual duel on the Delta. And let's talk about how last year was. We had a great, a big turnout there, a, a huge spectator turnout for the event. Uh, the first day, the second day was a rain out because we did have a tropical storm that was coming in then. So We're Sorry about that, Clint. <laughs> <laughs> I won't take credit for that. <laughs> but this year, we're getting ready for another big year and the turnout. You know, we talked to you last year about the economic impact that it has on Baldwin County. And you have people coming in from all over. Right. We have racers that will be coming from Texas, Louisiana, Tennessee. We, and we have a race teams that are coming from the Florida Keys. So they're driving 10 and 12 hours to come race with us for the event. So we're looking forward to it. For those who don't know about this kind of event, let's talk about the boats. Because last year I met you on location. I got to see for myself one of those boats. But tell, describe the boats, how fast they go. That's the big thing. Well, they're going to be racing on two courses. One will be a quarter mile course and the other will be an 800 foot course. Now, these boats will be re reaching speeds of 120 plus miles per hour and that'll be an 800 foot course. So it's very exciting. I mean, even the spectators get an adrenaline rush from watching this, this sport. And not only is this a, a fun event for the family, the entire family, but it also proceeds benefit some very good causes. Absolutely. The North Ball and Search and Rescue, they'll have their dive teams and also their rescue boats on site, and they benefit from this event, and also the Lions Club of Baymanette will benefit from that as you're, well. You were looking at some of the video from last year. I kept trying to take Clint's boat from him and let me take it out, but I think he was like, yeah, not so much. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us where the, the event is going to be located. It's at Live Oak. It's at Live Oak, the newly renovated Live Oak Landing there in Stockton. If you've been by there, it's a beautiful race site. Um, it will be held. It'll be a two-day racing event, so it'll be Saturday and Sunday. The gates open at eight o'clock. The races will begin at twelve noon. And you're going to also have food. Absolutely, you have to have food out there, Clint. Absolutely, <laughs> Chad Stapleton Catering is going to be uh, cooking up hot dogs, hamburgers, cold drinks. The only thing you need to bring is a lawn chair, and there's beautiful sh there's shade out there, so you don't have to worry about or getting... blankets or anything like that. Umbrellas, if they want to protect themselves, if they are in the sun, they can Absolutely. bring all that. Absolutely, it's a beautiful place to to it enjoy is. the event. I grew up there, Clint. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about the tickets. Um, as far as tickets are concerned, where can they get them? Can they get them? in advance or is it just easier to buy them on site? They'll be able to get them at the gate. Um, the gates will open at 8 o'clock. Wristbands are $8 for adults. Uh, children 6 through 12 is $5 and kids 6 and under is free. Okay, is that per day? That's per day, and they can purchase the wristbands there at the gate at Live Oak. Well, perfect. Well, thank you, of course, for coming on Studio 10. We're so excited about this, and we're looking. You guys are really hoping this event grows as we move, you know, through the years. Absolutely. We were blessed that the Outboard Drag Boat Association has chose Live Oak Landing as one of their premier race sites, so we're looking forward to years to come of, of this event. And the good news is, Clint, this year you don't have a tropical system affecting Let's it. Let's hope not. <laughs> Absolutely not. Well, go out and see Clint, see the boats. They're very exciting. We're going to put this information also on our website so you know about the tickets. It's not this weekend, but next weekend. So get your tickets. Here's a look at the information for Duel on the Delta. Clint, thank you so much for coming you, in, Pat. and we wish you the best of luck. We'll be right back.